What's up YouTube? This is Square2448 with episode 16 of Farming Simulator 2015 and I've driven this tweets to the sell point. We're gonna sell it. We're gonna sell it for 30 grand. That's a lot of money we have. And 75. Wait, does this have more power? Let's look. That did have more power. So, we aren't going to buy one just yet, actually. We have to move out of the way of this harvester guy. And I hopefully think, nope, I'm going to have to do it for him. There we go. Um. Don't drift. Oh, and we missed it. That's just great. Oh yeah, we're fertilizing. We'll get back to fertilizing all the fields before we sell these two. And I, then I want to see how much money we're left with because I don't want to leave us with less than 20 grand at the least. I don't want to make us go bankrupt. That would not be funny. Do we do have a loan actually at also? So we're just gonna go on to the couple next fields that we're gonna buy. We do own a lot of fields at the moment, so that's pretty good to know. Um I'm just going to drive over this and see how much fermenting it's only at 7%. It's not that good. Now is this? I, I believe I own this one. Nope. Now is that corn? Yeah, it's corn. We're all done with this. So we do have another field of corn. So we're going to harvest that once we're done with all the silage that we have in there at the moment. Actually, we're just going to cut through right here. I, only one mirror is really good to see out of at the moment. And see the other one's being blocked. So we're just going to turn in here. Sell that. No, please sell me. Okay, just fall inside it. That's good. Back up. There we go. Sell, sell. Okay, so. We'll buy the tractor once we're done parking all this up. Since I have not decided yet on a tractor. This is a very nice bale auto sacker. It does eight, so I believe it's like four tall or something like that. I mean, I hope I don't have to wash it just from transporting it to the shop. I'm gonna go and cap for all this. Pretty nice. It's good for a small farming operation. Now actually we could just drive it through which we'll just that. Uh, oh. Drive it through right uh, here. For now. Actually comp we'll just put it back over here. There's no really harm if we Okay, that's a fountain is good. back this in
That's good. So now we're gonna go and get the um baler and the cedar. We might not be able to tow that with this, and I hope we will. But we really only I believe we only have three no, two tractors on the farm and a harvester which put the weight back on. Go find the weight that's right here. Does it not want to, like, let me use it? Is that what it's going to try to do? Oh, yeah. I turned it the correct way. We'll get the bailer first. There we go. We could easily do this, but that that cedar I don't think we could do. And we'll go bail and then we'll see, so we'll just get the cedar with the other tractor. And where I want these garaged like underneath the shed so that like it's all nicely organized we we'll leave well the cedar could go in front of that corn harvester since we won't be using that for a little and the tractors will just be parked in one No, we could probably just put the, um, oh yeah. We'll just wash this up really fast. There we go. So now we're just going to just park it in front of the auto stacker. We'll push the auto stacker a little bit farther back. Will it fit? Yeah, it will. Okay, so we're just going to, let's just say, Keep this all. We didn't fertilize that field, but oh well. And I want to probably just get the New Holland tractor first. Well, I'm trying to decide on one tractor, which would be best. So we're gonna wash all this up. Uh oh. No. Like that.
Okay, so this is all clean. And we're actually just going to go pick up the tractor. We will pick up the new tractor, and if we we aren't gonna get the front loader attachment yet, so there we go. Now this weight, I like how they put the weights here. It's a nice and organized place. Um, there we go. It's not in the best condition part, but it will do. Oh no. These weights, I don't really care if they're really dirty. Alright, so. That's Surrey. We do have a Surrey. Um. But, where am I stuck? Oh no. No, we let's get this harvester. Let's fold it up. And we're gonna put this indoors since it's a really nice one. That pretty nice harvester. beacons also we're gonna put in that drive through we're just gonna back it in and it should fit if it doesn't we'll move a couple things around actually there's another one of these over there also so yeah the tractor is gonna go in there oh. now this might I'm gonna try this in cap, but I'm not sure if I can even do it. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, the header won't fit. We'll just lower the header like that. There we go. That's parked up. We'll just get the planter now if we do pull a wheelie. It's what we can do, but we'll also buy our tractor while we're down here. And if we can, we'll buy the front loader, which I'm not sure we can at the moment. Because that's like 22 grand or I don't know. We'll look. Stop break. Oh no, don't want to move that. So this cedar cultivates also. Okay, that would still be good. So we're going to go to tractors, buy a 64 grand tractor. Now how much is one? Five grand. We're definitely going to buy that. We're going to buy the ones that we do need, which will be the bale in the bucket so we're gonna haul that up next and we will put a weight on that that really won't be used other than sheep and probably cows but we'll also use it I know where I'm gonna park that actually whoa we lost control there So we're gonna move the harvester over one in there, and then we're gonna have that open space for the um front loader, which will will be nice. And then all of that will be indoors, and we'll also get the sorry indoors for now, since we aren't gonna use it. How far can I put this back? That should be good. Just gonna park this back here for a minute. Get to this. It's it's a small piece of equipment, but it will do what we need it to. So 
I don't really want to touch the front loader attachment. I want it just keep it the way it is. Okay. So we'll just put these all inside so that they don't rust. And since we won't be using it for a little, I still bought it because we do have a lot of money, which that's nice that we do have money because we're probably going to buy some cows in a little. Because we do need some slurry to fertilize the fields. And we only need to feed them a little bit because these fields don't really take much. Now what's this? Let me look in this one. Well, not. Well, the combine. Let's try the combine in there. If it does, it it might fit. Let's try it. If not, we'll move it over one. But I hope it just goes inside it. Yeah, I don't think it's going to. No. Okay. We'll just put in the second one here. And we'll just put a weight with it. We'll get the cleanest weight that we have. And we'll put it there. Just like that. Oh no. We're going to put the fertilizer in this. The slurry one in this one also. So. This is a, just a nice spot for these. And actually, yeah, the sorry could go right there. It's brand new, but once we start using it, I don't want it next to these, so we'll keep it outside. We'll probably use it for bailing, but... I don't want all the attachments on it. So, yeah. This is really the only thing we'll need. But we will be getting a big front loader once we get to the point where we need that. But at, at this point in time, this tractor will be used. And then we'll probably bring this up to the sheep area and just have a small sheep operation where we can make some money so that will be good um, we're, not, we're just gonna park this up and I don't want to touch the arm for this because I want it to just go down the way it usually does instead of just because we won't be using this for a little anyways. Okay. Like that. We'll get the Surrey tanker. Which I don't think I could get by here. Yeah, I can. This is a very small and nice shockers. That's why I like it. Does not have a front? Because it can't. Um, yeah, I can pull it. We won't be using this for a little, so. So, yeah. We'll just keep this indoors. Keep it new until we actually just start doing the poop. That fit? Yeah. This is like the expensive barn, even though it doesn't have that big of a tractor and stuff, it still is nice barn because of that opening there. So what's the cleanest weight? That one. It's probably the smallest, but we don't need something big at the moment. So yeah. 
we gotta back this in and we're just gonna block it in because when you, when we do use that front loader you have to have the weight on so yeah we'll just park this like this yeah so we've done what we needed to do for this episode so as you can see we do own most of the fields and that's growing so this episode will come to a close so like always like comment and subscribe